Hello and welcome to another episode of Tiki Live Help Desk. This week we're talking you through the process of integrating WordPress into your broadcasting experience. You can do so many things with a WordPress account, especially when you have Tiki Live. Your audience size now has the ability to expand with WordPress. Not only is your content on Tiki Live, but it's also on your own completely customizable WordPress. With your link Tiki Live WordPress, you're able to view your live channels and videos right from your WordPress pages. Any changes you make to the content that plays on the player will immediately be made to the player on WordPress. If you have your own WordPress that isn't linked to your Tiki Live account, you can still have your content available on that site simply through embed codes. You can put them in posts or on pages so that the player will be available in multiple places and again, any changes made to the content from your Tiki Live account will be made immediately to the embedded player on your WordPress site. So we've gone over broadcasting using WordPress, and we've gone over pay-per-view before and how it's such a great way to monetize your account and make money. But did you know that you can combine the two and charge pay-per-view for live and recorded events through WordPress too? It's as simple as doing it through your Tiki Live account and letting all the saved settings automate to players for that video or channel. Go into your Tiki Live account, select the video that you want to set for pay-per-view, allow the video, and set the price. Right away, tickets will be available for purchase on both your Tiki Live page and your WordPress site. You have an events calendar in your WordPress dashboard that allows you to create events just as you would in your Tiki Live account whether it's for some physical event out in the world, a reminder, or a live stream that you intend to broadcast to all your viewers. Your viewers will even be able to view your events in a calendar format to see what you have playing when. This is perfect for setting up pay-per-view live events so people will know when the events are going to occur and whether or not they're going to need to buy their tickets in advance. They can click on the live pay-per-view broadcast in your WordPress and purchase the tickets right there without having to leave the page and venture over to your Tiki Live account. On a Tiki Live WordPress, your My Channels and My Videos page come automatically with the site, so there's hardly any setup at all. Any channels or videos that are disabled will not be able to be viewed on your site, but all of those that aren't will be perfectly visible. You're able to set parameters for your Tiki Live channels and videos to be displayed on their selected page by going to the Channels or Video page configuration in the Setting tab of your WordPress dashboard. You can alter settings like the default page, number of channels you want to be displayed per page. The Videos configuration page will have the same options only for your My Videos page. On your actual My Channels page, you can see the layout for your channels. Each channel is listed on the page with its accorded thumbnails and video title. You can search through the listed channels or select a particular category to view. The rating for your channels and videos are even pulled over from TikiLive.com to display that content's current star rating. You can copy the customizable embed code from your TikiLive channel or video page, then paste it onto your WordPress site. This will make it so that your player from your Tiki Live account is viewable on your WordPress even if your account isn't linked to it. Pay-per-view with WordPress is just like setting it up with Tiki Live. Everything is done on one end and is automated through to the other. Simply go to your Tiki Live account, select the content that you wish to make pay-per-view, allow the pay-per-view abilities, set the price, and save your settings. You will now see that the video is set for pay-per-view on your WordPress site as well. For live events, anything set up on your Tiki Live Events calendar won't automatically transfer, so you will have to set up an event in your WordPress event calendar to let viewers there know as well. From your WordPress dashboard, under the Events calendar, click Events to open the Events page. This is where you will add a new event where you can add details such as the event title, event location, event description, event category, 
and start and end dates and times. Here's where you can place the link to the live stream event for viewers to follow and purchase a ticket to. You even have the option to make events reoccurring on set intervals just as you do in Tiki Live. Like with Tiki Live, you can post your broadcast to Facebook from WordPress by copying the stream URL pasting it into your status area in your Facebook account, and posting the update. Users will be able to watch your streams and videos right from Facebook.com without having to leave the page. WordPress is just another one of those ways that you're able to ma maximize your streaming experience and your followers viewing experience. It creates a whole new field for you to dive into and provides so many more capabilities, like being able to customize your own site and pages to your design while still having your content available right from Tiki Live. It's very convenient and prosperous, especially since you can now use Pay-Per-View through WordPress as well. This has been another episode of Tiki Live Help Desk, and I hope you've learned a little something new. Keep an eye on the lookout for more content coming soon, and we hope to see you live on Tiki Live and WordPress too.